Our fourth award is a sustainability award given to an individual or organization demonstrating outstanding initiative, leadership, and accomplishment in protecting and preserving the natural environment during an exploration program, development, or operation of a mine. It also recognizes efforts to establish and maintain good relations with local communities. Tonight, we recognize B2 Goal for exemplary resettlement and community development work with the village of Fadugu at the Fakola Gold Mine in Mali. Here is their story. When B2 Gold acquired the Fakola Mine in Mali in 2014, they saw an opportunity to improve the lives of the local community and implement in a concrete way the values of transparency, accountability, respect, and fairness the company stands for. Pensez derrière le l'objet le projet du de nouveau Fadugu était surtout déjà de montrer que mais avant tout nous sommes là pour le long terme. Donc nous avons on nous avons depuis le départ enfin quand nous avons décidé de pouvoir de de, de déménager le village de construire un nouveau village pour ces populations. The project involved resettling 913 households and 3272 people who lived in the old village of Fadugu. Ownership of the, the resettled village is critical to its success. And so we set up a training center where we trained uh, the community members themselves to be the ones to build their, their new homes and their new community. So we have a formation of the masonry, and the creativity, and the entrepreneurship. So we have a formation of the exam. So the masonry is a mission to be a premier. So we have a direction to be a masonry. The overall scope of this project was not to just build uh, a new village just with B2 Gold people. The idea was to get the village involved, have them take ownership. A resettlement committee was formed which included female participation. The committee met 39 times and conducted more than 2,000 individual meetings during the consultation process. I'm really proud of this process because all of the key decisions were made together and that's what is important to make them happy in their new village. And that's, that's what really matters to us. And Bitigul also has obtained its engagement with regard to the construction of the social economic cultural of the village. I think that today, it's what makes me proud. The resettlement projects didn't stop at building houses. There will be electrification in all the families. There will be the infrastructure public. Il y a la construction du passé, il y a le, la construction de l'Utouga, il y a les écoles, il y a les centres de, le centre de santé communautaire, il y a le mosquée. Bitigol nana dougou, on a ramené à Moussoulora. A radio kou wassa ta Moussoulora. Masi, tout le masi, Bitigol n'a pas dit. On a dit qu'il y a un peu de temps, on a dit qu'il y a un peu de temps, on a dit qu'il y a un peu de temps, on a dit qu'il y a un peu de temps. A market garden was also created. Currently, we're in a phase of monitoring and evaluation, various metrics to ensure uh, that the people are successful in their move. And we continue to invest in the community to ensure their long-term development. The village of New Fidugu celebrated its grand opening in January of 2019. The coal mine and the Fidugu village are examples of what people can do
Here with us tonight to accept the 2021 Sustainability Award is Ken Jones, B2 Goals Director of Sustainability. Ken, this is such a heartwarming story. Uh, thank you, yes. Um, it has been a joy to see the community grow and thrive and, uh, and now have such a potential for a promising future. Um, I'd like to thank uh, the PDAC for selecting B2 Gold as a recipient of this award. Um, I'd like to take this opportunity also to recognize just a few of the many dedicated persons involved in this project. This work was carried out over several years, and while we get to celebrate these achievements here in this moment, it's the people on the ground who embody and carry out day after day B2 Gold's values and, and make this possible. The FACOLA Mine Community Relations Managers developed and led the resettlement project, Jean-Philippe Santo and Hassan Oedrigo, and the project's civil engineer, Ben Scott, who led the community construction team in building their new community. And also, I'd, I'd like to thank the community members and the leaders of the Fadugu Village themselves for their willingness to work with B2 Gold to give us their trust and respect to partner with us and achieve this together. So again, I'd like to thank the PDAC for this recognition. It is an honor to be able to accept this award on behalf of B2 Gold. All right, Ken, thank you so much. And once again, congratulations. Thank you very much.